In this lesson, I'll show you two examples on how to calculate a molecular formula from an empirical formula in molar mass. In question one, we're asked, butanidione, a main component in the smell and taste of butter and cheese, consists of the elements carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. The empirical formula of butanidione is C2H3O, and its molar mass is 86.09 grams per mole. Determine its molecular formula. So we've been given the empirical formula, and it's C2H8O2. Let's write that down. We have carbon, which has a molar mass of 12.01. We'll multiply that by 2. And we'll multiply the molar mass of hydrogen, which consists of 3 in this empirical formula, 1.008 times 3. And finally, oxygen which has the molar mass of 16.00, will be multiplied with 1. Let's go ahead and use our calculator to compute this. Bracket 12.01 times 2 plus 1.008 times 3 plus 16.00 times 1. And we end up with 43.044. 43.044 grams per mole. Now keep in mind that in that calculation we multiplied and then we added. When you add for significant figures, you need to keep into account the lowest number of decimal places. So given that these two numbers have two numbers after the decimal, we should limit our number to two numbers after the decimal as well. So anything after this four is considered insignificant. Now we found the molar mass of the empirical formula and we know the molar mass of the actual formula, it's 86.09. Usually the empirical formula is the reduced version of the molecular formula. So what we can do is take the larger of the number and divide it by 43.04. So I'll take 86.09 grams per mole and divide it by 43.04. That will give us a factor, let's call that factor n that number n will then be multiplied to each of these subscripts. So let's find out what 86.09 divided by the number that we just got gives us. We end up with approximately 2. So our factor n is equal to 2, and so I'll multiply this c by 2, which gives me c4, h6, and o2. That represents the answer to question number 1. Let's move on to question number 2. In question two, they ask, a compound has the empirical formula carbon hydrogen, C1H1, and a molar mass of 78.11 grams per mole. Find its molecular formula. So I'm gonna give you a moment to figure this out, and I suggest that you pause the screen and see if you can come up with an answer. And here's what you should end up with. We have carbon, once again, at 12.01 and hydrogen at 1.008. Notice that I'm not multiplying these molar masses by anything because here C is 1 and H is 1. All we have to do here is add these up. 12.01 plus 1.008 and we'll limit our number to two numbers after the decimal. So we have 13.02 grams per mole. We'll divide 78.11 with this number, like this, where I have 78.11 divided by 13.02. That gives us approximately 6. So our formula is C6H6. Now, if you would like to see how question number 3 is done, which is a little bit different than question 1 and 2, make sure you watch the next part of this video and that is how to calculate a molecular formula when given the empirical formula.